welcome this is the Solaris X and today I'm going to show you um, why to export on OBS settings and the reason why you need to export OBS settings is if your OBS messes up you can back up your scenes and your sources so to do so what you gotta do is go to profile export this once you've got your sources on your once you got your scenes and sources all sorted you go to first of all your profile and export your profile and where do you wanna export it you wanna save it directly to desktop it will be easy to remember right by there and then you go to select folder as you can see there that's your uh, profile done now scene selection you wanna go to scene selection export and now you wanna again go to your desktop and save it under my scenes right by the hit there so thus saving all your um, OBS settings your sources your uh, images so let's say we've ac accidentally deleted your profile for now, I'm going to have an un untitled profile and I'm going to delete this profile here. So I want to remove and so what we're going to do remove this one and scenes we want to remove them as well and now as you can see we haven't got no scenes no nothing because we've deleted it now to import it back all we have to do is profile import is to import your profile desktop my profile select folder now that's just the profile imported now you want to import your scene scene selection import go where you saved your scenes in this case it's desktop my scenes open now when we go here you can see your profile back and scenes my se your scenes back now you have to give it a few seconds for it to re-register itself re-import everything again and as you can see there you got all your stuff back and everything is where you left it without the need of losing any of your image how you lay it out and everything like that so that's a really good idea to have to sort of um, ex export your profile and scenes on OBS not to lose any um, images any d data or anything like that so you don't don't have to redo it over and over again so that's a really good tool to use on OBS if you need to reformat your computer then you don't have to set up your OBS settings from scratch I hope you've enjoyed this and all the best take care